A senior at Bloomington High School South earned a $100,000 scholarship for a mathematical discovery that could aid in encryption. Pat Bean reports. Everyone wants to believe their online communications and transactions are secure. The way companies secure them is through cryptographic algorithms which use really large prime numbers as their keys. But there are some numbers that mirror primes. And that's problematic because these numbers, which are called Carmichael numbers, uh, show up as primes even though they're not actually prime. And that leads to weaker encryption. So Larson went to work on understanding Carmichael numbers based on a 19th century finding on the large gaps between consecutive prime numbers. And what it says in particular is that for every x there exists a prime and between x and 2x. And so uh, I showed that uh, the analogous result is true for Carmichael numbers instead of primes. And that should make it easier to filter Carmichael numbers out of the equation and make your transactions and communications more secure. Last week, Larson made his presentation at the prestigious Regeneron Science Talent Search in Washington, D.C. And out of the 40 high school seniors competing at the week-long event, Larson placed fourth and earned a $100,000 scholarship. Just making it to the nation's oldest science and math competition was an accomplishment. More than 1,800 seniors entered the talent search this year. Former competitors have gone on to win 13 Nobel Prizes and are leaders in the industry. You know, I think it's not so surprising that a lot of them became um, very important scientists, but of course it is still like cool seeing yourself in the same uh, competition that all these great scientists were. For Indiana News Desk, I'm Pat Bean. Larson has been accepted at the Massachusetts Institute of Technology, but is waiting to hear from other universities before making his final decision on where to attend college.